This is question 5 from paper 2 of the 2015 National 5 SQA Maths exam. We're shown a couple of vectors, P and Q, and we're asked to find the components of the resultant vector P plus Q. So a couple of ways that we can uh, do this question. First one is by drawing the addition on this grid. So we're looking at this vector q and let's move that vector q to start where p finished so we're looking at p plus q as a journey going from here up to here followed by a journey q from here down to here so there's your start, there's your finish. And therefore the resultant vector is this vector here. There's a representative of P plus Q. Starting here, finishing here. We've gone one to the left, two down. So doing it this way, we can immediately write down that the resultant vector P plus Q has components 1 to the left, that's minus 1 along the x direction, and 2 down, that's along the y direction, so that's minus 2 in the y direction. So there's one way of uh, doing this question. So another way of doing this question is to look first at the vector p and decide what its components are. So we're starting here finishing here. We've gone 5 to the left and 3 up. So its components will be negative 5 in the x direction and 3 in the y direction. 5 to the left, 3 up. Let's do a similar analysis of vector q. We start off here, we finish there. So we've gone 4 to the right and 5 down. 4 to the right in the x direction, 5 down, negative 5 in the y direction. So these are the two components of vector q. So the resultant vector p plus q would be the sum of these two vectors, components of these vectors, and to add components we add corresponding components. So negative 5 plus 4 would be the x component and 3 plus negative 5 would be the y component. So negative 5 plus 4, think of a number line, you go 5 to the left and back 4, you've ended up at minus 1, negative 1, and then 3 to the right plus 5 to the left you'll end up at negative 2. 3 plus negative 5 is like 3 minus 5 is negative 2, which agrees with the components that we got before. Before, So either draw the vectors sum P plus Q, giving you P plus Q, or write down the two sets of components and add them to get the resulting components.